First of all, you need to download or clone the repo. Once you have downloaded the repo, open, open it and extract it. I have already extracted it here. And once you have done that, you need to open your command prompt and navigate to the same directory you have extracted the project in. And in here, you need to type python setup.py install. And this should install all the modules you need for this project. After doing that you need to do what you need to do is create a Twitter application for that you need to visit uh, apps.twitter.com and you need to first login from your Twitter account. After that you need to create a new app for that you need to click the create new app button and you need to give a, give a name to your app and you need to enter some description and you need to enter a website after that you can check developer equipment and create your twitter application and this will create a twitter application for you now go on keys and access token now here you have your consumer key and consumer secret what you need to do is click on create my access token and this should generate the access token and access token secret there they are now what you need to do is you need to copy all these consumer key consumer secret access token and access token secret and paste it here in scrapper.py so let's open it okay so i i have already pasted my consumer key and consumer secret here so you need to paste them here and you are good to go so before we proceed i need to you know uh, very, uh, tell you about some variables so here basically the tag is the keyword which we want to search about the limit is the number of posts or tweets we want to scrape and here you can choose your browser as chrome or firefox whichever browser you, need, uh, you want to use this in this process of scraping and here the language uh, uh, it will all uh, the language by default is English and it will only scrap English tweets. If you want, uh, if you want to scrap tweets of any other language, what you can do is visit the link which I have commented out. And here are all the language codes. So if you want to, uh, if uh, let's say if you want to uh, scrap Chinese tweets, what you need to do is. Uh, the code for the Chinese tweets is uh, for the Chinese language is zh. So you need to uh, pass the string zs zn zh instead of en. Okay. So here we will scrap uh, the tweets in English. So once you have do uh, done that, you need to run this file. You can then uh, you can run this program. So. enter keyword to search let's search for fifa and let's scrap 10 posts from instagram and 10 posts from twitter so it should create a new folder as you can see here data which will contain all the information for that keyword now it is scrapping instagram using selenium uh, as we have passed chrome in the options so it is using chrome for the scrapping and it will it will load instagram pictures a bit slowly because there is some delay uh, if i haven't put some delay in loading the pictures then it's, uh, then instagram would have you know blocked my ip because i'm scrapping data from there so there you go it has downloaded instagram images now it is starting the scrapping the twitter And there was one image in any of the tweets, so it has also downloaded that, and the scrapping has been finished. So now let's see the data which it has dumped. Here, is it, here it is the data dot uh, data underscore FIFA. So here are the images. These ten images are from Instagram, and this one is from Twitter. 
and these are the excel files for the tweets let's open them so here's the fifa underscore trader let's see what this file contains so in the post sheet you can see the complete post here the here are the posts here are the tags and the frequency there were the world cup hashtag was used two times and there are the external links that were mentioned in the post or tweets now let's see the instagram uh, the captions from the instagrams and the instagram post so here in the caption sheet these are the captions to post uh, the first two posts didn't have any caption so the field is blank and these are the hashtags used the hashtag fifa was used 11 times the fifa world cup was used 5 times and you can see all the hashtags used so this is basically the scrapper so if you have any problem uh, you can drop a comment below Eyes in the sky, gazing far into the night, I raise my hand.